and we're back guys i'm your host good energy we are in italy that's right we have a grass 125k and alicia parks is in the building ladies and gentlemen but first let's take a look at the seated players as this is qualifiers tatiana maria who's a great grass player she'll be taking on arena barra in the first round the number two seed don't cry for me argentina carly she's gonna take on camilla raki mova the number three seed boozes monero she's taking on to doni who's been playing very very well lately the fourth seed sarah Ira Honey, <laughs> she's going to take on Stevanovic, who's a great shot maker. The fifth seed, Renata Zarazoa, the first Mexican to win a WTA main tour championship. Arunka Kova, she's going to take on her in the first round. The sixth seed, Haley Baptiste, that's right, one of the best shot makers in the world right now. She's amazing. She's going to take on Padone in the first round. The seventh seed. And Dreva, ladies and gentlemen, she's going to take on Rostello in the eighth seed, the hard hitting lefty American Bernarda Pera. She's in there as well. This looks like a great draw, guys. I will be covering this tournament. And what about Alicia Parks, the hard hitting American? She's your 22nd ranked American, guys, right? She's trying to climb the rankings. Now, listen, a rough year. We all know what happened. She never had the opportunity to defend her title in Lyons, France. Therefore, having to go qualify for, you know, the replacing tournament, she lost a ton of points. And uh, from there, it's been downhill ever since. Now, she did start off the year pretty darn good, making it to the round of 32 at the Australian Open. Before Coco ran into her, and that was a red hot Coco on what a uh, eight match win streak. She would beat Parks, make it uh, I want to say seven or eight, and then she beat she beat a couple other players after that. I mean, she took out the hard hitting Marta Kashu, and she would storm into the semifinal. But Alicia Parks, guys, struggling on the year three and six, she jumps out to a fast start. That's right, 6-1. She takes the first set. Now, Parks, we saw her a few years ago in Berlin, right, where she, she beat Queen Win and she challenged Ans to a tiebreak. Now, I think she's a good player on grass. She's got an amazing serve. We all know that. A wide serve. She can volley. And that's the type. And she's very fast vertically. That's the type of game that does well on grass. And right now, she's in a battle because you know what? Siskova actually came back and won the second set. Now, Siskova, a lot of people don't know who she is. Listen, guys, she's a pretty good doubles player. That's right. She's 73rd on the world tour in terms of doubles. She's from the Czech Republic. She's got skills, guys. On grass, she hasn't played a grass tournament in, what, a couple years? 16 and 11 on the year. She's a, she's a pretty solid clay player. Clay is her specialty. And she took the second set from Parks. That's right, guys. She would win the second set. And she did it really behind the first serve, right? Winning for most of the second set, about 70% of her first serves. And she got the break points against Alicia Parks. So we pick up here in the third set. Listen, someone's going to win this match. Will it be AP? Right now, we are on serve in the third set. Alicia Parks has six aces alone in the third set. For the match, she has 12. It looks like she's getting back to that fast, aggressive serve that led her to the top, right, inside the top 40. I think she'll be back there by the end of the year if she continues to serve like this. I'll keep you covered, guys. Third set, someone's O must go.